objective mineralogy multiple choice questions with answers these are uh, useful for various competitive exams like csr net gate gsi civil services exams and other exams welcome to set 7 first question bronzeite is a variety of a hypersthene b diapside c enstatite d augite so bronzeite is a variety of the hypersthene it belongs to pyroxene mineral group Next question. June olivines have rims of A. Forestite, B. Tephorite, C. Iddingsite, D. Phyllite. Correct answer is D. Phyllite. June olivines have rims of phyllite. So here, uh, next question is X is equal to pink, Y is equal to yellow, Z is equal to green. It is the pleochroic formula of which mineral? A. Jadeite, B. Ageride, C. Vigionite, D. Hypersthene. So, the answer is Hypersthene. Hypersthene shows the good uh, pleochroism and here X, it represents the pink and Y, it represents the yellow and Z, it represents the green. This is the pleochroic formula of Hypersthene. Next question. The chemical composition of CaSiTiO5, it belongs to which mineral? A. Topaz. B. Periscite, C. Spin, D. Mullite. Obviously, Spin has a chemical composition of Ca, Si, Ti, O5. Next question. The pleochroic absorption of Han blend is represented by A. X is greater than Y. Y is greater than Z. B. Y is greater than X. X is greater than Z. C. Z is greater than Y. Y is greater than X. And D. Z is greater than Y z is greater than x x is greater than y so correct answer is c z is greater than y y is greater than x next question match the following and choose the correct answer they have given a b c d and uh, 1 2 3 4 are given so a is uri b andradite c cinnamon stone and d almondine 1 2 3 like variety of grassular chromium garnet iron aluminum silicate calcium iron silicate so the choices are a 2 b3 c2 d4 b a2 b4 c1 d3 c a1 b2 c3 d4 and d a4 b3 c2 and d1 so we had to choose so here uh, the correct answer it becomes a a is nothing but uh, uro white is a chromium calcium garnet and andradite is calcium iron silicate and uh, cinnamon stone is variety of uh, grass solar and almondine is a uh, iron aluminum silicate or iron aluminum garnet so here uh, the correct answer is b next question the sharpest transition or inversion point occurs between a alpha quartz and beta quartz b tridimite and cristobalite c quartz and tridimite d quartz and cristobalite so correct answer is uh, the sharpest transition or inversion point it occurs between alpha quartz and beta quartz at 867 degree centigrade so, correct answer is A. Next question. The most common alteration product of plagioclase feldspars is A. Epidote, B. Scapolite, C. Chloride, D. Mica. Correct answer is B. Scapolite. So, plagioclase generally alter to scapolite. Next question. Electric charges developed on opposite phases due to lack of stress is described as A. Piezoelectricity, B. Pyroelectricity, C. Phosphorescence, D. Fluorescence. So, correct answer is pyroelectricity. It is a phenomena where it is, uh, that means electrical charges are developed on opposite uh, crystal phases due to the lack of the stress. Next question. Epidote shows an elongation along B axis because it crystallizes in orthorhombic system, monoclinic system, triclinic system, tetragonal system. So, epidote crystallizes in monoclinic crystals. Next question. Parpiment is a mineral of A. Antimony, B. Molybdenum, C. Arsenic, D. Gallium. Parpiment is a mineral of arsenic. Next question. The specific gravity of a powdered mineral can be determined with the help of A. Chemical balance, B. Picidometer, C. Jolly spring balance, D. Walker steel yard. So, correct answer is 
B picnometer it is useful for uh, determining the specific gravity of a powdered mineral. Next question. Which of the following exhibits pyroelectricity? A. Hemihedral crystals. B. Tetartohedral crystals. C. Holohedral crystals. D. None of the above. So, correct answer is tetartohedral crystals they exhibit the pyroelectricity. Next question, polysynthetic twinning may be described as A, a type of repeated twinning in which the successive composition surface remain parallel, B, a type of repeated twinning in which the successive composition surface does not remain parallel, and C, a type of twinning in which the individual imitates a, 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 exhibit a higher symmetry, and D, none of the above. So, correct answer is polysynthetic twinning is it's, it's a type of repeated twinning in which the successive composition surfaces remain parallel. Next question, which mineral is biaxial and exhibits pseudo-hexagonal symmetry? A. Biotype, B. Olivine, C. Mica, D. Microcline. So, correct answer is B. Mica, it exhibits uh, biaxial and exhibits pseudo-hexagonal symmetry. Next question, the minerals of which of the following series show isomorphic series? A. Olivine, B. Silica, C. Geolite, D. Felspathite. The correct answer is olivine group of minerals, they exhibit isomorphic series. Next question. Crotch has twinning of microcline is due to a wedge shaped twinning on A. Albite and periclin law, B. Albite and calcibad law, C. Albite and nanibac law, D. Calcibad and periclin law. So, correct answer is A. Albite and periclin law. Next question. Which of the following is the blue variety of corundum? A. Sapphire. B. Sapphirine. C. Ruby. D. Amethyst. So, obviously, sapphire is the blue variety of corundum. Next question. Chayastolite is a variety of A. Adalusite. B. Actinolite. C. Hornblende. D. None of the above. So, chayastolite is a variety of andalusite. Next question. A Betran lens is used to study A. Refractive index B. Interference figure C. Optic sign D. Optical anomalies. So, Betran lens is generally used to study interference figures. 